Hi guys, in today's video, I'll be teaching you how to fix Clayfab not creating a new player thing, and you know, the player's not showing up when you load into your game. So if it's your first login or something, it doesn't create a player in Playfab. It's pretty much just like a new thing that Playfab has been doing. And I figured why not make a video to fix it because a lot of people have been having this issue. But yeah, it's a real easy fix. Also, don't worry about my nose. I was at the pool and I was swimming and I hit my nose. Anyways, let's get straight into the video. So here we are in our game. Now, assuming that you followed my fixed Playfab tutorial, it'll also be in the description. Your Playfab should look something like this with your title ID and it should say Unity Web Request. But this issue is likely if you made a new Playfab studio rather than if you have an old one. But anyways, let's test this out. So if we click play here, what should happen is since it would be our first login because I connected it to a fresh Playfab, it should make a brand new Playfab player for this player. So we're in, we're moving around, connected, whatever. Now we're gonna go out and we're going to go to players and click search and as you can see, there's no players found, even though we clearly just logged in. So what you have to do, go down here to settings. It's down here now, rather than being like up here and here. So go to settings, go to API features and scroll down and on disable player creations, just uncheck the top one that says login with custom ID. These ones you can keep checked if you want. If you want, you can uncheck them. It's up to you, but make sure to disable the first one here click save and now we can go back to unity we can click play and you know we're connected now we can go out we can go back to playfab and i'll even refresh the page here and then we can click search and as you can see our player is here so once again in order to fix this just go to settings go to api features scroll down and uncheck disable player creation using client login with custom id then click save it's that simple i hope that this helped you even though this was a really short video i still have to say please like and subscribe and make sure to join my discord server link in the description if you need any help with any of my videos or if you just want to be part of my awesome community and please consider becoming a channel member because you get so many awesome perks including getting to see my videos earlier than the normal viewer and including a shout out at the end of every single video that i make just like all of the wonderful people on the screen right now thank you all so much also please comment down below some video ideas that you want me to make because they're very helpful for me thank you all so much for watching and yeah guys that's it for me today peace